All right, so with some of the signs we're going to be making for uh, the bears and Bertaria, this is uh, these are old braces that used to go at an angle. See the angle cuts? They would go like this in between the joists of a hundred year old house to keep them from turning. And whenever we renovate houses and we knock these out, they're unpainted hundred year old wood that has been dried and underneath the house. So I save them because they make great signs. It shows all the old characteristics on there. And you can even see the lines of the mill saw that cut it over a hundred years ago. So today we're gonna to be pulling the nails and making a whole bunch of straight cuts. So we're about to get to cleaning. Fun times. There you go. You don't give up on it. We gotta get all the nails out because I don't wanna cut through them with the saw. You're learning though, right? Yeah, this one's very very difficult. Yeah. Don't don't give up on it. You just gotta find another way. I don't wanna damage the wood. But we're gonna be cutting we're cutting off the ends. I appreciate that thinking, but we're gonna be cutting off the ends. Turn it 180 degrees. No, flip the board back over. Turn the hammer 180 degrees. Pull towards, like going towards the mailbox. Mm hmm. You got it right there. Oh. Hold the wood. Yes. I'm holding it. Okay, sometimes you have to latch on and you can go straight. Flip it over. Okay. Hold still. Try. Use the little corner of the nail, the corner of the hammer right here <laughs> to try to. Dig it. Now, now look how much it's sticking up, right? Yep. And then you put that on there. There you go. You're going to make it put it in the pile of nails right here. Okay, good job. And that's the stack of our finished product right there. All right, we're doing good. So, some of these are going to be made into the signs for the bears, like, uh, like uh, you know, Owen's family and uh, Slap Weasel and Bowler Bear and a few others. Um, Marie might even get me getting a sign, I don't know. You know what the best ability is, Seth? Ever. No. Responsibility. Accountability. The ability to learn. Without the teachability, you don't have accountability. Without accountability, no one will give you responsibility. And you want the resp responsibility, because with the responsibility, you get things like respect. Life lessons, bro. There you go, you're getting it. There you go. Why don't you straighten your pile, dude? Hey, straighten your pile, start a second, take two of those down, put it, start another pile. Nice to get, there we go. We'll have a whole stack of them by the time you're done. Be ready to cut and make some signs. It'll be fantastic. All right, and then while you do that, I'm gonna take these behind you and cut them at the saw station right here.
right there, it just blends in with the wood. Alright, don't worry about that one. Can't we just cut off a little more? I would, if I don't have to, yeah. Show a little bit of the actual building process, dude. I know. We'll just, I didn't know. You'll be fine. I know, but I didn't know. You know what it smells like? Wood. History. Made of wood, yes. See, look at this, look at this, look. See how every single one, look, if I line them all up on this side, look, they're all a different thickness, and they're all a different yeah. width. All right? No wood, my friend, no wood. Oh, my God, I can't touch you. Yes. You can do it. We can help. saw the sign. Yeah, I carved it up myself. I made a sign. I made him up for better. Yep. It's gonna make a funny songs and make my son cringe. He'll be like dad to stop. Oh, oh, oh. That's a song from way before you were born. I know. Well, I didn't know when it was made, but I know the song. You know, only like two decades ago. I made the sign and it opened up my eyes because I am happy now building for Batabataria.